Well, uh, just talking about, uh, I mean, qualifying for the outdoor championships, just what was the emotion like, especially, you know, getting it on that third and final throw there? Um, I feel really very grateful. I thank God, of course, for everything. I was praying to him the whole time. And I feel like my hard work, hard work really paid off, so it was really a good thing for me. Absolutely. You know, you, you get to your last throw. How challenging is it to have your best effort on your last attempt, you know? Kind of a pressure throw. Yeah. It's definitely like, it's, it's like you're going against yourself at that point. It's very like mental, it's a very mental game. And I feel like I just had to persevere. <laughs> yeah. You know, per as you prepare for something like this, I mean, do you, you know, do you reflect any at all, like just where you were at the beginning of this year to where you are now? I mean, what's that, what's that process like for you when you come to you know, mm -hmm. prepare for something like this? Um, so my, my teammate was actually telling me like when I was first throwing, like I threw so little, probably about like 14 meters to now I'm going to nationals. Like nobody can believe it. Um, it's, it's just always a big jump. I always, I always love to look back and see how like my throw has progressed. You know, how would you say you've been able to kind of make that, that jump up to where you are now? Um, practice, 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 practice. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Yes. What's kind of been your progression here as a, as a thrower? I kind of looked at your, you know, you, you know, you've been here for a couple of years. Mm -hmm. How much do you feel like you have improved over your career here? Um, I feel like I've improved mentally. I feel like I've been through many mental blocks. I've improved physically. I've gotten stronger, quicker, and I feel like I've very much matured in every aspect. You know, as a thrower, did mm -hmm. you feel like what, your best event when you got here was the shot or the discus? Did you have a preference there? Or? It was actually the discus that I was, like, here for. And then coach just drilled me on shot put. And then <laughs> I became good at it. <laughs> or better. Yeah, become accustomed to that. Yeah. yeah. Is it to a point where you prefer that now over the over? Definitely. Know, Absolutely, Definitely. yeah. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Yeah. Well, what's, what's been the key to making that jump in the shot or improving so much over the last couple of years? I feel like shot puts more strength, and I feel like I'm strong and quick. And discus is more of technical wise. It's more of a dance, and so you gotta you gotta know how to dance. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. yeah. Have you looked at the competition to see you know kind of what you need to do mm -hmm. to finish where you want to finish at nationals? Um, honestly, I don't like to look. I like to focus on myself because at the end of the day, it's my throw that's gonna make it, not whatever what everybody right. else is doing. <laughs> Uh, then just, I guess, looking, uh, you know, getting ahead to that point, I mean, just kind of what's the preparation look like for you? I mean, what, what are some things that you're doing between now and then just kind of getting ready for it? Um, I'm mentally getting ready, like saying positive things to myself. I repeat oh, repetition and that's basically it. Repetition, muscle memory. There you go. Yeah, I know you've thrown in some big meets, but this is like another stage altogether. You've given a lot of thought to throw it in front of a crowd in, in Eugene. I'm excited. I love a crowd. <laughs> awesome. Good. Um, any any goal? I mean, any goals you have distance-wise for this? Just simply a PR? Or? Um. Yeah, I want a PR definitely. I feel like if I PR, I'm not going home a loser. You know. <laughs> True. True.